Hello there. Could you help me fix these? They're for my son, but I have no money. We don't fix things for free, man. Hello, sir. Could you please help me fix these shoes? They're for my son at school, but I have no money. Why don't you get a job, you... Hippie. Hello, man. Listen, could you please help me fix these shoes? Um, my son needs them for school and I have no money. I'm... Do you want me to repair them for you? For free? Well, yeah, but... Listen... I've been looking for a job for a couple of days and I can't find one and my son really needs these shoes to go to school and he cannot wear them like this, look at them. He needs to go to class, he needs to go to school. Please, please help me out. Please. Well, man. These are rough times, you know. no job work is not easy to find so I'll, I'm gonna help you out really are you gonna help me look before asking you for help I asked several others and nobody wanted to help me so that's why I'm surprised that you wanted to why are you helping me I understand bro I've been in a similar situation, and I know how, what it's like, so I'm gonna help you out. Today, you and maybe you can help me out later. Why do you say you've been in a similar situation? Can I know what happened? Well, it's a long story, you know, but I've been through dark times have struggled I mean I am working but um, I have seven children and I know what it's like not being able to give them what they need so that's why I seven children you look way too young to have so many damn well it's a long story man I don't want to take your time really difficult and I don't want to bother you. No, don't worry, don't worry. Um, I can, I can listen to you. I have no problem, okay? If you want, I can listen to your story. You can trust me. Well, the truth is that I, I, I do have seven children and I'm supporting them by myself. My wife abandoned us. She left. He met someone else and uh, I had three children with her. She was older than me, so she already had four of her own. I accepted her, her with all of them, and then we had three of our own, you know, and we made our family, but then she ended up leaving. And that's why I'm here from 7 a.m. to 10 p.m. And there are a lot of expenses with so many children, but I'm, I'm willing to do it. You know, I'm willing to, to make it. Listen, sorry for asking, but um, I just can't believe that a woman is able to abandon her children. If... You guys were having so many. I'm sorry for saying this, but not even an animal would do that. Why would she do that? Well, I really never knew what happened or what went through her mind, but you know, I always, I always gave them what they needed. It was a good time. I, I was doing good at, at work. The problem was that um, eventually they fired me. Just one day they did. And then 
I started spending everything I had using credit cards, taking loans. My family isn't willing to help me because I owe them so much money. When she saw that the situation was getting difficult, she decided to leave, you know. And she wasn't happy about the situation. And she found someone else who could provide her what she wanted, you know, what she needed, what she was used to. And that's how it happened. And what has been of her? I mean, has she tried to... I mean, I know it's not your fault, but it seems like she never loved her children. I'm sorry for insisting on that topic, but it seems like she's really cruel. That's not what a woman's nature should be, you know? She should be devoted to her husband and children. No, man. She, she never returned. We know nothing about her. They asked for her, but... I told them the truth. She left us. But I'm gonna be here for you. I'm proud of you. I'm gonna take care of you. And I'm going to support you. I have no other option. I, I love them all. And they have a good father. I'm gonna be with them. I imagine that your kids are going to school. And... Maybe they have told you, you know, how children are. They always say what they want to be when they are, when they grow up. Yeah, of course. I mean, they were used to looking at me as a successful man, you know, wearing suits because I was, I was aiming for something better. I wanted to be a lawyer. That's why I'm pushing forward for my dreams here. This is my only option, to work hard. But I'm not tired. I want to go on. I want to make it. Congratulations, young man. You are an amazing father. And besides being a good man, and you have no bad feelings for this woman who abandoned you and your children. I'm pretty sure that it's not easy to do that and it's not easy to be the sole support for so many children. So that's why I would like to thank you for being such an amazing father. Look, the truth is that, well, I don't know how to say this. <sighs> well, this is this is a social experiment. Um, I, thankfully, I do have a, an, a stable income. My family is okay. My children have amazing shoes. Are you mocking me? No, 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 no. As I was saying, it's a little difficult to say this. I'm not. I'm not mocking you. What I'm trying to say is that I'm making this social experiment to test how kind people can be. A lot of people were mean to me. They didn't want to help. They offended me. And you are the only one who actually lended me a hand. You are helping me with these shoes and I'm really moved by your story, by your, your wife's story, how she could leave all of you. Please. Take the shoes. This is for you. Oh my. What, what is this money? This is too much, man. Of course it's a lot. But it's for you. You deserve it. For being such an amazing father, this is going to help you. So you don't have to worry for a while about feeding your children or clothing them. You deserve this. No, oh, man. Look, think about it. 
It might just be the universe giving back to you after everything you've been through, after that woman abandoned you. When she left, you were abandoned by her. This is just God giving back to you. Whatever's in that box is also for you. Please take it. No, man. Is this too much, dude? No, no, no. It's not a lot. Please. I've had an amazing life. And I just want to give back a little bit of what God's given me. This is for you, for your children. When I woke up today, I knew it was going to be a good day. And look at this. That's right. God is sending it to you. For you only. <laughs>